All right, what is going on, everybody? Welcome back to Search Goose My Career. And yes, this is a little bit different. We have something to change with these PC My Careers because I can't do it on Xbox. Yep, as you can see in the background, no fans. This is the arena that the NBA bubble is where they're currently playing. Thank you. Oh my god, the mods for 2K are insane. If I knew the modder's name, I would, you know, put it up on the screen, but I honestly don't know. But whoever made this mod, bro, you're the GOAT. Um, it's the Raptors court is like that. Like, it shows the Raptors court because of their jerseys they have on. But it's actually just the normal NBA Black Lives Matter court. That's the court that's the base court for this mod. But I guess since the Raptors are wearing these jerseys, it overrides it. Nonetheless, as you see from the back, it just looks amazing. Honestly, it looks so good. I don't know how they did this, but they did it. And you know how we start these videos. With the three and its buckets. But yeah, this freaking mod is amazing. I forgot to mention, if you guys are new here, be sure to subscribe because we got NBA content every single day as the ball gets stolen. Um, f like I said, for every series I have on PC, um, I'm going to have... The arena is going to look like this. This is what the arena is going to look like. It's just so good. It's such a change of pace just looking at this because these, like, electronic boards, they don't change, sadly, which I don't think you can make them change. But this looks so cool. Kevin Love, you took a terrible shot. Why'd you take that? But yeah, it just looks so cool. This is what we're going to stick with for now. Um, did I say like and subscribe? I probably did. I don't know what I'm talking about. Let's just get to the game. Oh, Kevin Love with the steal. Give it to me, Matisse. I'm going to... Oh, I'm running the floor, man. I, yeah, that's not great, bro. Okay, never mind. Now we're going in the post. This isn't Cedric's game, but we're doing it post fade, and it misses. Yeah, Cedric, and that's that's not his game. Colin Sexton with the dime. Oh, I see Matisse. Oh, never mind. Why did you shoot that, Matisse? You know you ain't making that shot. Wow, we are playing insane defense right now, and he decides to go back up with it. I forgot to mention that. The Raptors are actually a half a game behind of us in the Eastern Conference standings. We are the third seed, and they are the fourth seed. So, this is a pretty pivotal game, seeing we're in March, and there's only, like, a month left of this current season. So, the Raptors could really use this game, and they will be boosted to the third seed. Oh, I'm getting subbed out here, up by one, and we're up by 13, dude. Our bench is actually pretty damn good. It's led by Darius Garland and Obadai Toppin. And I, oh, Alonzo, Alf, Alfonso, Alfonso, I still don't know his name, McKinney. So our bench is pretty damn good as, oh, I can, okay. He was about to go up for a dunk. I contested that shot very well, but he still got it to go because Cedric's not the biggest point guard as I pull up for the three and it buckets. All right, the Raptors are slowly coming back. Slowly, but surely it's only a 14 point game now. Obadiah Toppin, do not take that shot. Even though it says you can shoot threes, uh, do not take it. Matisse, don't take that shot either. Okay, we're going to run a, you know, pop. Pick and pop with Obi Toppin. He's going to pull up for the mid, and it's buckets. Now, Obi Toppin was drafted in the same draft class as me. So, maybe next season, even though Kevin Love's having a great year, maybe next season Kevin Love's expendable. Possibly because they clearly drafted Obi Toppin to replace Kevin Love. Kevin Love's got a big contract. We can probably get some good assets for him seeing he's averaging a great season, averaging 17 and 10. So, this, we're making the playoffs. We already clinched the playoff spot, so. But Kevin Love is very much expendable, so you might be able to get something for him. Maybe maybe a better, maybe a better small forward, even though Matisse has been very viable. I don't know. Colin Sexton apparently is unhappy, even though I'm gonna pop this three and miss. But Colin Sexton, for some reason, is unhappy. I, I think he'll be fine. I think he'll end up... I am 3 for 8. I am playing terrible. But yeah, Obi Toppin has played great, at least when I played with him. So, possibly Kevin Love might be on the trade block. Another player I was thinking about, you know, maybe possibly on the trade market is Mr. Darius Garland. Now, when I was injured prior to this game... Um, I guess it was like a fractured right hand. I don't know. Darius Garland started. He averaged 17 points and 9 assists. Right now, he's averaging 11 and 5 off the bench. Darius Garland, I don't see him as a bench point guard. I see him as a good, solid starting point guard. And since I'm in Cleveland, they're going to have to choose between me or Darius. Right now, I am the clear favorite. 
but we don't know. Maybe I become unhappy in Cleveland. No, the, we may never know. But as of now, you know, this two-point guard, actually technically three-point guard monster because Colin Sexton came into the league as a point guard. It's been working out, all right, even though Colin Sexton is more of a shooting guard in my eyes. I don't know what I'm talking about. I I'm just going on because we need we need to reach that 10-minute mark. Darius Garland, I see you. Pull up that mid-range. There we go. I was about to say, don't make me look stupid for calling you good. They also play me alongside Darius Garland a lot. So, I don't know if that's a sign. Maybe they want to get rid of Colin. I don't know, but I play along Darius Garland sometimes more than Colin Sexton. We're starting to approach the end of the first half. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. You're going to disrespect me like that? This is supposed to be a Curry slash Kyrie build. Mainly a Curry build. You can't be disrespecting Cedric like that. But yeah, like I was going to say, we're approaching the end of the first half. And the Raptors were rallying back till I hit that three. But, you know, this is still an F14 point game. Gasol going to hit the post feed? No? Okay, I don't know what Gasol's doing. He's just running out the clock. Oh, okay. I was sagging off on Lowry. Yeah, I was. He answers right back. But I got my takeover. And you know what that means? You know what that means? Um, it means I'm going to miss a shot because I, apparently when you have takeover, you met, never mind. Green bean with 1.9 left to give us a 14 point lead going in the halftime unless Kyle makes a shot like against the Heat in the playoffs in 2016. Yes, I remember that. That sucked. It was in game one, but we still won that game, not the series. Nonetheless, up by 14 going into half. All right, start of the third quarter, 68 to 54. Colin Sexton already has 20 points. Yeah, okay, sure. 20 points, 2 rebounds, and 1 assist. That's not Ben. He's been doing that when I'm out of the game. So, apparently, we just thrive when we're not in the game. We just don't play together much. It's mainly me and Garland. And when I'm not in the game, Sexton's in the game, and he goes off. I, I don't... I, I, it, we're winning games, so I it's working. Oh, what a block from Drummond. Oh, that's easy. Buckets, that's gonna... Oh, I thought it was an and one. But I'm going to the free throw line for the first time this game possibly put us up by 19 give me that give me that steal um drumming keep cutting drumming keep cutting please keep coming drum there we go andre drumming with the windmill slam that's one player i really don't want off this team is andre drumming you want to know why because in 2k he is a god oh i'm getting subbed out didn't even notice up by 18 up by 14 okay maybe 15 of Colin Sexton hits this all right we're up by 15 right now two and a half minutes left in this third quarter this this is this is a fourth seed Raptors they might come back it's this game's definitely not over not even close to being over um we got JaVale in the game we got OB Toppin um Colin Sexton and I'm not sure who's running our small forward maybe McKinney um it is definitely McKinney I don't get to play with McKinney a lot and I actually really like McKinney in real life no he's not great but I honestly, I like him as a player. We're going to try and get him going. Well, okay. All right. He's pump faking. What are you doing, McKinney? Okay. What is going on? Alfonso, however you say your name, because I struggle for some reason. You are not. At, okay. What? Okay. I just realized we have the two NBA vloggers right now on our team. We have McGee and Matisse Leibel. They're both like the faces of the NBA vlogs right now for the bubble, which are amazing. I guarantee should go really go check out Matisse and JaVale McGee's videos. They're freaking great. But yeah, I just realized that. That's dope. Colin Sexton, I see. Okay, he got fouled. But yeah, <laughs> in this fictionary world. Fictionary? Is that it? We'll say that. Uh, Matisse and JaVale on the same team vlogging. Damn. Colin Sexton, he only scored two points this quarter, though. But he does have six threes. Damn. Three, two, one. Oh, that's a bad shot. That's a bad shot. All right, we're up by 14 going into the fourth. I'm very confident I'm shooting terrible right now. Um, eight for seven. Okay, I'm five for ten from three. Surprisingly, Obi Toppin has 21. Oh my God, this is this is a future big three right here. I didn't know Obi Toppin was balling like that. Oh, Javale, that was a steal. That looked like a foul. Oh, what a play! And at any other time, that is a foul. That is a foul animation. But JaVale actually got the steal outlet down court as I was cherry picking Bucket. Damn, that was smooth. All right, the Raptors are slowly coming back in this game. Oh, Colin Sexton. Hassan, I don't know what you're doing running to the perimeter, but Colin Sexton is balling right. Okay, they're slowly coming back. It's now a 13-point game. 
because we have not really been making shots. At least me, I... Nope, I can't make anything right now. But, I still think we got this game in the bag. If we end up blowing what was almost a 20-point lead with fouls like that, like, I think three or four players have three or more fouls already. So that ain't good because they're in the bone... Oh, okay, I'm getting subbed out. Let's see if our bench can keep it going. I got subbed out for a couple seconds. Okay, never mind. Never mind. Kevin Love set the screen. I'm going to pop that three. Um, Drummond, why? Why? Why Why do all the big men in this game just immediately put the ball up? I don't know. I don't get it. Oh, Matisse, you just got sauce. But, Drummond, why are you attempting nine shots? Why are you attempting nine shots? But Matisse just got sauced by Norman Powell. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I'm popping that. Come on. Oh, it's a bucket. Back up by double digits. Bro, I'm Steph Curry out here. I don't know how I just made that. I am legit Steph Curry. Bro, we've made 12 more shots than them. Attempted 11 more. And they are still in this game. 12 more shots we've made than... Okay, that's probably a big reason. But damn. Oh, that's a green. Bro, that, that honestly might be the dagger. Unless they come back with a three-pointer. There's a minute and a half left. That might be it. And that green, that's it. That's a dagger right there. Oh, okay. Okay, Cedric. Calm down a bit. This is a PG program. That's it. That's a dagger. I'll see you at the end of the game. All right. About 10 seconds left. I told you this game was over. We're back up by 13. It's too easy, man. This Raptors team was actually pretty formidable. Pretty good team. I'm going to pull up. I that actually got all... Ooh, it almost went in. We're going to walk out in our first ever NBA bubble game. For the 13-point victory over the Toronto Raptors to put us a game and a half ahead of them and keep the third seed. Box score for the Raptors. Norman Powell and Pascal Siakam both went off. 20-plus each. Even Hassan had 17, 13, and 3. Lowry had a terrible game, shooting-wise. Um, for us, Aaron O was the leading scorer. Cedric Lewis, 44 and 11. 16 for 31 from the field. I did take 31 shots, yes. 10 for 19 from three. This dude is unconscious from three. In only 29 minutes, Se Sexton had 31 and six. He was also flaming hot. Obi Toppin did not score at all since the last time we checked. No one really did. It's just been, yeah, it was just 21 rebounds from Drummond. Oh my God, Drummond. But yeah, Colin Sexton and I, this right now, for that second half, it was all Colin Sexton and I for the game. It was this possible future big three right here. I gotta get Obi Top in the cyber face too. But yeah, this might be the future big three in Cleveland. That's gonna be it for me. Leave a like if you guys did enjoy. Subscribe if you guys are new. GG.